He has received the Doctor's Choice Award and multiple Patient Choice Awards, even so far as to have his accolades displayed on the jumbotrons in Times Square. He has also been interviewed on international radio stations, been quoted in the Wall Street Journal, New York Daily News, FoxNews.com, New York Post, Cosmetic Surgery Times, The Week Magazine, among others. Dr. B has been a longtime board member of A Vintage Affair, a wine tasting charity organization where close to $2 million has been raised for women and children in need in his hometown. And he even has his very own personal wine label, the aptly named Perfect Profile. Dr. Bergdorf, welcome. And thanks for taking the time for this discussion. My pleasure, Angie. Well, let's get started with why the Excellence in Cosmetic Surgery member network. There are roughly 8,000 cosmetic plastic surgeons in the country. So what makes you the expert in the business and marketing of plastic surgery that all these other doctors aren't? Well, many doctors struggle with the business and marketing part of a practice. It's not their fault. We're not taught this in med school. You know, we come out of med school as highly skilled surgeons, but business cripples. I know it's for a fact. I was one of these guys. <laughs> We spend a lot of money and time looking for that magic bullet advertising or marketing that attracts patients. Many struggle with fees and competition. Now, in a little less than a decade in private practice, competing against the big boys, I've invested over half a million dollars of my own money in education, marketing, and advertising and discovered what really works. Now, that's not to say I haven't had my share of flops. I have. <laughs> we all have. What, what many doctors misunderstand about marketing and advertising is that it's all a test. This is okay. Everything you do in marketing and advertising is testing. You're looking for what works best. You're also looking for what doesn't work. I invest as much time, effort, and money in studying and learning marketing as I do in staying on top of top plastic surgery techniques and technology. Now, in short, the EICS program is a culmination of what works and helps member docs avoid wasting time getting their practice to where they want it to be by avoiding the same costly mistakes I made along. Well, that brings a level of expertise to all of this that few doctors could ever afford to access on his or her own. Yeah, a level they couldn't afford and, and many, quite frankly, would abandon long before they discovered the real success. Okay, what do you mean by that? All right, so it's not a dispersion against my colleagues or the profession. Most docs don't have the resources to invest in enough marketing and advertising to gather great data. 